Allie, fans were treated to an incredible game, but mm -hmm. also incredible weather. I mean, perfect for sitting outside today. Oh, it was absolutely gorgeous out there outside the stadium. I mean, I'm sure with a bit of that breeze in there, that warm sunshine, we continue that even into this week with temperatures again back to almost near 70 degrees for multiple days. I mean, it's feeling more like spring than it definitely is heading into November, but temperatures are going to go up and down. We go from 70 to 60 and then we make that happen twice, but we do see a very dry week ahead. That's why we do feel on the warmer side, but it's rain chances that happen late week that eventually will bring us back to a little bit more on the normal side and you can see right now temperatures dropping back to the low 50s all across the land 43 though right now out in Frederick 57 in Annapolis. We likely wake up temperatures again in the upper 40s, low 50s, so pretty similar to what we're seeing right now. So keep that in mind. Nothing really to track on radar. Just another boring sight that we've seen for the past couple days. But for those who have enjoyed the sunshine, you've really liked to see something like that. But you see clouds likely moving in again as we get into late tomorrow. That'll come with our next system that is going to be pretty weak, so it will bring temperatures at least on the cooler side, at least not the 70s we saw today, but 60s aren't too bad and we can just stay well off tomorrow morning waking up again closer to 40 near the state line, maybe closer to 50 in the inner harbor and eastern shore sunshine throughout the day, so we're feeling good getting into the low 60s. So I'm sure in the shade it's going to feel a bit chillier out there, but not too bad, especially when the sun's out. Clouds will thicken into the evening. It does look like we could see some clouds for most of Tuesday. This model run wants to show showers. I will tell you that I think we're just far too dry, but temperatures do remain on the warm side. Look, upper 60s, we likely get low 70s all across the land. The clouds just hang out and over us and keep us pretty warm. It's once we get later into the week where we go back down, of course, the roller coaster and we see 60s again. I mean, low 60s, we go from 63 to 73, 62 to 73. I mean, almost basically the same pattern. We just duplicate it two days in a row. It's likely once we get to Friday where that cooler air comes back into play and unfortunately just wants to stick around, but that's also the best rain chance we have right now. Right now it's looking like a Southern Maryland rain event, but things could change. It could become a little bit more widespread and the seven day forecast definitely shows all of the nice weather that we have and really we're going to enjoy the next couple of days because dry skies and 60s and 70s are definitely what I'm talking about for November. It's once we get back to the weekend, not only do we see temperatures cool back to seasonal levels, but we see a pretty nice day, especially for your Veterans Day.